guys now, run here, and boy do I have the project for you. I have been working, um, three days on this, and what this is, is an analog 12-hour redstone clock, which beats the snot out of my analog six-hour redstone clock. Um, this runs on the Minecraft day, which is 20 minutes long, um, and divided into 24 hours would be 50 seconds apiece, um, and what this is, is 12 50 second delays, um, each one is 125 repeaters, I took out 5 though, just to compensate for the other repeaters that I used to extend the current, um, and what it does is it's on for 50 seconds, and for that 50 seconds it's on, it is turning one of those torches on. And it goes through like a snake, um, starting over here, or all the way over there, going up here, going up to this, going all the way over there, all the way over there, all the way over there, and then back to the beginning, which is by that tower. Um, which is noon. Um, it was a very hard project to make due to space, time, and obviously the fact that I'd used billions upon billions of repeaters. Um, I think it's about 4,000, by the way. So it's not an easy project. Um, I wouldn't suggest making it in your spare time either. It was a pain in the ass. Um, and there are still quite a few bugs with it, like, on occasion, if you're too far out of the chunk, the redstone will stop moving, and, like, the clock will freeze, because you're too far away. And what I tried to do was, um, put wolves here, sitting down so the chunks wouldn't unload, but I'm pretty sure they still do. Um, it's a pain, but I gotta move along with it. So, I gotta find something else for that. But I'm going to be putting this on the SMP server that I will be doing the Let's Play on. Um, I'm gonna be putting a bot that won't despawn somewhere back in here. So it won't uh, pause or anything, and I can just get full fluid motion. And even when the server's down, it'll still be gone, because uh, technically there's still something in there keeping it working. So, um... Sundown is at about 6.30, um, which is the time, currently. Um, now it's 7, yeah, it's about 7. 7, 6.30. Um, it goes fully down by about 8, 8.15, about. Um, and midnight is obviously 12 o'clock, and the moon or slash sun should be perfectly overhead at, um midnight slash noon cause well I calibrated it that way but it was a pain in the butt to calibrate I have to say that cause I had to leave it on for 50 seconds exact and uh, um this is probably the 6th time I've done this to try to get it as close to perfect as possible um cause it's so hard to set you just put a redstone torch down and leave it for 50 seconds it's evil um, but it was a fun project, nonetheless. Um, I'm glad I did it in the long run. Um, it was probably and will probably be the biggest redstone project I will ever do. And I'm sure there was an easier way to do this than 12 s strings of, uh, 50 second delays. Um, but I tried, like, the flip-flops and the RS nor latches and those didn't seem to work for me so um, <laughs> I had no idea how to implement them is what I'm trying to say <laughs> so I ended up doing this and this works fine um, I'd have the chunk unloading issue if I wasn't user if I was using the latches anyway so turn rain off real quick um, so it's not like make a big difference and if you guys want I will be putting the save for this world um, uh, I would need a handful of comments before I do that because it is a pain in the butt to upload to and zip and all that so if you guys do want it please comment um, also throw in a thumbs up just to motivate me more um, 
that does help. Uh, more thumbs up I have, the happier I'll be. Um, and I am working on a few other projects at the moment. Um, expect the next video to either be on the fully automatic dispenser, see it just changed. Um, the fully automatic dispenser update, I made a video a while back and it got a few thousand views. I wasn't really happy with how it turned out though, because I know a lot more than I did back then. So I'm going to be uh, do redoing that and making it so much easier to comprehend. Um, for all you non-redstone junkies. Uh, I'll also be doing a... Uh, well, you know, I'm not going to spoil that one. But as you guys probably know, I'm doing the SMPLP soon. My friend is struggling to get the server up. He's been having internet connection problems. So as soon as that's up, I'll tell you guys, and it just changed again. Um, almost midnight, so it says it's 11 o'clock. I'd say that's about 11, maybe 10, 10.30. Um, but it's not perfect. It won't ever be because the calibration issues. Uh, oh, God. The, this thing is such a pain in the butt to calibrate, though. I absolutely hate doing that. And the reason I'm flying around so much is so these don't unload. I'm terrified as if, to, as to if it would. Like, there's some redstone glitching there. Uh, but yeah. If you guys do want to make this, though, um, all it is is a display with torches where only one would be on. And it's 50 second strings, which would be 125. It just changed again. Uh, 125 four delay repeaters just wired up in a line. And as soon as it finishes the 125, it goes to um, a separate station where it is put to one of these. Um, let me see if I can find a good one. Here, the blue one's good. Um, like, you just finish with the blue one. So it will go up the blue through here and power the blue. And, um, it works pretty well. It's it's pretty darn accurate. I would th think about uh, sizing this down if I didn't spend so much time on it. it was such a time drain. Um, I didn't use, like, MC Editor or any of that, so laying those t repeaters was terrible. Um, as you could probably imagine, it's 4,400 repe repeaters for all those that want to know. So, you're, you're probably not going to be able to make it without inventory editing, and you're probably not going to be able to make it with, uh, with, er, without much patience either. So, um, yeah. So I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Um, if you'd like the world save, please thumb up and leave a comment. And I'm just going to let this run through its paces. Um, thanks, and see you guys later.